Okay, my friends, I know that people don't like to spend more than a, a couple of minutes, so I, I usually get attacked and say, go quicker, go quicker. <laughs> no, I'm trying to cure cancer and all chronic disorders in 35 minutes. Well, I'll try to give you the, the highlights in three minutes because 35 minutes is a long time for most people to spend to try to save their lives. <laughs> Hold on. I could just show you this picture and go away. What happens is there's mucus that coats every single lining and cell and tube and every single thing in your body has to be separated from everything else. Sooner or later, tissues break through this mucous membrane if you don't have the correct chemistry. I know the correct chemistry and I know the reason this happens. It happens to every single organ in your body. Pancreas, this guy's this one, esophagus, you got rectal cancer, you got colon cancer, you got this, you got that, stomach cancer. I mean there is no unknown cancer and they are all due to breaking through the barrier and invading the tissue. The doctors think that the body is invading itself. No, the body is trying to fight against the invaders and it ends up consuming itself and they are correct about that. But it is not for the reason they are stating. And I'm going to show you, this is the way the body works. They can say anything they want and you can do anything you want. I'm not telling anybody to do anything special. But I'm going to tell you one thing right now. This is how the body works and mucus is your friend. All right, here's the video uh, that uh, you should watch, and watch it in its entirety. Now, this is the mucous membrane, and the mucous membrane has these little niches in here, and these are everywhere. There's not just one little spot here and there. They're everywhere. You have thousands and thousands of different bacteria in your body. Most of you is bacteria. They live in these little niches. They create slime, and other bacteria lives along with them as a community. You wipe out that community, it gets invaded by somebody else it's not supposed to be there you got an issue all right this starts right out it says mucus layer hosts a distinct intestinal microbial niche there's a spot in your gut in all your different areas where the mucus is which is everywhere that host certain bacteria. More than half of you is bacteria. It's living there to do the job of creating the mucus and the membranes and the barriers and the transition metals and all the things you need to live on. In this, uh, in this uh, video, it's 35 minutes, you're going to have to watch it if you want the details, but you have to rebuild your mucosal microbial niche and the barriers and once it gets destroyed and you get through those four barriers into four ca cancer stage four then you are screwed I would watch the video healthy unhealthy mucus and separated mucus non there membrane destroyed attacked all right, just remember this. You are nothing more than a factory. You take in deliveries. You have salt areas and acid areas and different areas where they paint things and where air comes in and goes out and, and, and you waste and trash areas here and there, and you end up being able to do work. But if you don't take care of that factory, nothing is going to end up working. It's, everything's going to fall apart. It's going to rot, just like a factory. I mean, that's all you are. That's all you are. And inside of here is all the nerves. This is all where the computers are up in there. And somebody gets salty things, spills things all over them, and there's no insulation, or rats get in there, start eating insulation. Then you got all kinds of problems, and you start twisting and flipping and doing all kinds of things. And that's what happens to people when they have these um, neural motor diseases. They, their neurons are firing and shooting a different thing. We're supposed to be saying, okay, take it easy. And the guy's flipping like this. It's what happens. Okay, my friends, the rest is up to you. Mud Fossil University up here on YouTube. And um, thank you.